Every year, four million women become pregnant in the U.S. A heartbreaking 25,000 of those pregnancies are lost in the last 20 weeks, often for unknown causes. But recent technical advances in magnetometry promise to shed new light on fetal health, allowing doctors to better treat heart problems while still in the womb. The ECG is a fundamental tool used to assess the health of millions of patients every day. Almost all of the treatment choices that we have are based on the premise that we know what we're treating. But there's no easy way to gather an electrocardiogram from a fetus in utero. An echocardiogram can show the mechanical processes in the heart, but it cannot see electrical activity. That leaves doctors blind to potential heart problems. This electrical activity that drives the baby's heart creates magnetic signals which can be detected by a sensitive magnetometer. The resulting data can be plotted just like an ECG. It usually shows a single QRS complex that allows us to measure the P, PR, QRS, QT, and corrected QT intervals, which are uh, very important in assessing the risk of fetal demise. Magnetocardiography has been proven safe and highly effective, but current technology is prohibitively expensive. A new technology based on optically pumped magnetometer or OPM is expected to reduce the cost of the MCG by a factor of 10. The small size of the optically pumped magnetometers makes it possible that we could have a magnetically shielded bed as opposed to a magnetically shielded room. In uh, 2014, magnetocardiography was given a Category 2A designation, which means that the majority of physicians feel that this is important in the diagnosis of particular conditions. And um, that is unusual for a new procedure to get that high of a designation in uh, the beginning. With this OPM technology advancing as rapidly as it is, I foresee the day when every woman getting an ultrasound will also get a fetal magnetocardiogram as part of standard of care. And I hope that this will reduce the fetal mortality that we see.